السلام علیکم خواتین و زرات آئی ویلکم یو آل ٹو یٹ ان ادر ایپیسوڈ آف دا پاڈ کاسٹ دا سیکوس کرانیکلس پاورڈ بائی سیکوس یونیورسٹی ڈیفینیٹلی آئی ایم یور ہوسٹ ایما جاوید ابھی تک تو آپ مجھے جان چکے ہوں گے اینڈ وی آر ہیو ود ان ادر ویری امپارٹنٹ ٹاپک ریلیٹڈ ٹو کیریئر جو کہ ہمارے پاکستان میں آج کل جو کہ ڈفرینٹ فیلڈس آف ورک پیپل آر آپٹنگ ٹو گو فار تھنگس دیٹ ور ناٹ کوائٹ فیمس اور پریولنٹ ایف یو لک ایٹ دیم اے ڈیکیڈ اگو تو اسی طرح سے ہم کوشش کرتے ہیں کہ اس پوڈ کاسٹ میں ہم ایسے ٹاپکس آپ کے سامنے لے کے آئیں جس میں جو کہ نارملی ڈسکس نہیں ہوتے یا ان کو وہ اس قسم کی امپورٹنس دی نہیں جاتی تھی پہلے لیکن رائٹ ناؤ دیز آر یو نو دا نیڈ آف دی آر تو آج جن گیسٹ کو ہم نے بلایا اور جو ٹاپک ہم آج آپ لوگوں کے سامنے جس پہ گفت و شنید ہوگی جس جس مدعے کو ہم چھیڑیں گے آج تو شی ہیز بین اے فیکلٹی ممبر شی از اے فیکلٹی ممبر ایٹ سی کاز یونیورسٹی ان دی انٹیگریٹو بایو سائنسز ڈپارٹمنٹ آج تھوڑا سا ٹیکنیکل ٹاپک ہے تو دس ول ٹارگیٹ ڈیفینیٹلی اے اسپیسیفک آڈینس شی ہیڈ شی ڈیڈ ہر ماسٹرس ان جینیٹک انجینئرنگ فرام ایگریکلچر یونیورسٹی پشاور Uh, has been actively uh, doing uh, social work, has been a part of the development sector for quite a while, uh, been involved in, if, in philanthropic as well as in, in activities such as fundraising and things of the sort. Uh, other than that, she uh, has been affiliated to training and uh, development. If they go to her, they will do their introduction to themselves, but just a brief background about her. So let's go to our guest with uh, We welcome... میم سدرا ٹوڈے السلام علیکم وعلیکم السلام میم کیسی ہیں آپ آل گڈ تھینک یو ٹھیک ٹھاک ہیں فرسٹ آف آل آئی آفر مائی کریٹیٹیوڈ فار یو پریزنس ٹوڈے ان دس اسٹوڈیو ہماری اسٹوڈیو کیسے لگی آپ کو Uh, of course, I commented on, you know, the aesthetic okay. part of the studio. Um, it looks like it's, it, it looks very carefully put together. Mm-hmm. There's a nice shelf, there's books. And, okay. Um, I mean, it's for a creative person, it's kind of engaging and stimulating. Our pleasure. A teak ho gaya. Ma'am, just about a, b- a brief introduction about yourself. Vaise to I, I gave a generic background. Lekin for those who don't know you, CCOS ki students to aapko jante honge definitely. Lekin for the outsiders who don't know you, to agar aap apne baare mein, if you can introduce yourself a bit. Well, actually, you introduced me better than I could have introduced myself. <laughs> okay. Well, I, but I'll do it again. I'm okay. Sidra Amin. I've done my MS and BS from Institute of Biotechnology and Genetic Engineering mm-hmm. in Agriculture University. Okay. Uh, currently, I'm working as a faculty member of the Institute of Integrative Biosciences, All Sikos right. University. Mm-hmm. Before working as a faculty member, I have like an eight-year work experience. So I've worked in medical college before this. Uh, as a part of the regular part of the research management and scientific research team okay. uh, and before which I was working in the developmental sector mm-hmm. before which I was working in the public sector okay. as a teacher trainer a subject trainer science subject trainer and later on as a monitoring and evaluation person mm-hmm. a data analyst um, a communication back she was <laughs> okay 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 communication background you also have that all right yeah Um, as I, uh, what I wanted to say was that I was kind of a backstop for the okay. communication for the entire okay. KP okay. for a particular USAID project. So, I mean, it doesn't, a lot of people do ask me, okay, what's going on over here? Mm-hmm. And you have a degree in science and then you went into the social sector also and you jumped into the I was the about to ask that, Hanke. It, it is actually a diversified background, but uh, yes, any reason behind that? Um, well, as we move along this conversation, you will get to know okay. what's happening okay. over there. We are talking right. integrative biosciences. So there's an integration of lots of factors I'll actually. Okay. That comes off in your personality as well at mm-hmm. some point. So mm-hmm. you don't end up wanting one thing mm-hmm. or making changes in one sector, right? Mm-hmm. And also, um, I guess I, fe- I felt like my skills did not kind of limit me to one particular place. Okay. Combined with the fact that I couldn't find a relevant job for mm-hmm. some time. So I went in some directions which were very rewarding, by the way, and which I really enjoyed. Mm-hmm. So yeah, there it is. Okay, okay, all right. Well, let's get straight into the topic uh, because we we actually are, we have a limited uh, time to, you know, record this episode for all the audience. And as we can cover topics, we will for sure try to do that. Ma'am, uh, the very first question that comes to my mind, Biosciences ka naam to humne suna wa tha. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm, it, 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 it's also new, but not relatively new as that of integrative bioscience. اس کے بارے میں ذرا ہمیں بتائیں کہ وٹ ایکچولی از انٹیگریٹو بایو سائنس اینڈ ہاؤ از اٹ اینی ڈفرینٹ فرام دوز کنونشنل بایو سائنس ماڈیولز یا جو سبجیکٹس ہمارے پاس ہوتے تھے یو ٹیک آن دیٹ تاکہ 
बेस बना के वी कैन मूव फर्दर टू द डिस्कशन प्लीज ऑल राइट हियर्स अ थिंग जब हम कहते हैं कन्वेंशनल बायो साइंसेस सो फॉर अ लॉन्ग स्ट ऑफ टाइम वी वर नॉट इवन कॉलिंग इट बायो साइंसेस राइट वी वर जस्ट सेपरेटली कॉलिंग देम बायोलॉजी एंड केमिस्ट्री एंड फिजिक्स एंड परहैप्स मेडिसिन जस्ट फार्मेसी थिंग्स लाइक दैट सो इट हैज टू डू विद समथिंग के व्हिच टेक्स लाइफ एंड ट्राइज टू डील विद लाइफ ट्राइज टू डील विद द साइंस ऑफ लाइफ ट्राइज टू अंडरस्टैंड द लाइफ मे बी मेक इट एन अप्लाइड bio science so mm-hmm. maybe use some knowledge introduce some interventions and there's your biological sciences okay. and biological sciences is actually not very different from integrative bio sciences okay okay it but integrative bio sciences stems from bio just bio sciences mm-hmm. i'll just say mm-hmm. just bio sciences right mm-hmm. so integrative bio sciences basically takes all these different um bio sciences fields okay. takes physical sciences takes natural sciences integrates them mm-hmm. and comes up with approaches that should address all these problems in each of these fields by the way we call it integrative biosciences so life related bio related problems lete hain lekin approaches hum usme use karte hain baki fields ki perfectly said perfectly said i hope uh, that would have been that would have solved a lot of uh, questions about this particular topic acha mam aapne baat batayi ke uh, definitely we we come up with pre- uh, problems every new day right but there are some solutions uh, uh, behind that jo ke hum hamare log people who are working to solve those particular problems uh, bio uh, integrative bio sciences how in your opinion would that help uh, solving problems in different fields such as jaise ki hum le sakte hain anything that's related to pharmacy ho gaya medicine ho gaye iske alawa jo hai to hamare baki jo uh, bio ya medical sciences related fields jo hain how can this contribute this particular field i'm talking about integrative bio sciences how can this contribute to these fields in the upcoming days in the in the near future okay you take on that please all right you know as we um, you know progress into this modern world what we call a modern world jisme bahut zyada industrialization hai bahut advancements hai and of course it works for the human development mm-hmm. because human being the hot red center of the universe right mm-hmm. um it has its impacts mm-hmm. its good impacts of course but okay. at the same time its invasive impacts mm-hmm. and uh, traditional approaches ke sath kabhi kabhi unko solve karna balki aksar aukat usko solve karna mushkil ho jata hai yeah. and we've been using those approaches for mm-hmm. the longest of time okay. and still a lot of our problems keep on worsening mm-hmm. i'll give you an example okay uh, agar hum i'll just go and take the example of health mm-hmm. something that everybody can relate to all right uh, let's talk about cancer okay and cancer has been treated with chemotherapy radiotherapy and, and uh, different medicinal approaches and of course yes. they do work but also they have such invasive effects mm-hmm. and in the long run if you just um look at it from a bird eye view we'll see k it didn't actually solve the problem the mm-hmm. cases keep on increasing mm-hmm. yes we treat keep on treating them mm-hmm. but ultimately we are not dealing with the problem per okay. se okay so what is integrative biosciences mm-hmm. doing there mm-hmm. integrative biosciences mm-hmm. is taken let's just say an engineering technique right all right and from engineering what do we understand it as that we, we would understand engineering as you know building something mm-hmm. so civil engineering mm-hmm. and i'm I'm calling myself a genetic engineer because mm-hmm. I will take a gene which is a very life form right okay. and I want to build it into a gene that mm-hmm. actually addresses the cancer problem and I will you know cut at the gene I will introduce something in it mm-hmm. I will make it a different gene and I would hope for it to you know solve the problem okay. but here's and I'll come and address something that you might be asking me after this so I'll just go ahead and answer it right okay, away okay all right okay Mm, how is it developing over time right yes. so we started from bioscience mm-hmm. and the traditional bioscience and applied bioscience just am kehte the we basically did this basic thing as okay. in cutting open a gene and trying to change it again it will solve the problem to mm-hmm. one extent but it might have some other invasive effects to it okay so it comes integrative bioscience mm-hmm. we're checking out why those effects are happening mm-hmm. right so we're let's just say i'll take mathematics and mm-hmm. i'll take computers mm-hmm. and i do some analysis mm-hmm. and i make some softwares and those give me some answers and then i take that information and i try to do it differently this time okay and this time my uh, problem is solved in a better way than right. it was before okay okay so it's an improvement of course yes. right yes but again it might Uh, show me another problem because here's the thing with education and mm-hmm. research mm-hmm. the more you work towards something mm-hmm. the more opens up in front of you absolutely. the more needs to be done absolutely which absolutely. is great okay. too because yes. you you know there's a certain question that people ask what is more important mm-hmm. is it important to be in the journey or is it 
order to arrive at a destination, right? Okay. Okay. And I'm always the person who would say, okay, it's important to be in the journey because, like, once you've arrived, you've arrived. Mm-hmm. Yes, you start thinking over where you go next, right? But even in a act in an actual tour or trip, the destiny the Travel part is the fun part, mm. in my opinion. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. get to see so many things. You get to learn more about culture. Yes. You get to learn more about places. Absolutely agree to that. You yep. get to eat more food, yep. right? Yep. Yes, so yes, yes. This kind of thing is uh, this. It's very advantageous for the integrative biosciences, okay. as in more opening up of question mm. uh, opens up more areas of research, mm-hmm. opens up more jobs, mm-hmm. recruits more people to mm-hmm. the cause of it, mm-hmm. and in the long run, it will be solving problems of the world we hope so it does uh, research ki aapne baat ki ke definitely uh, with the passage of time uh, you know new topics will emerge as well of course kyunki jis tarah se aapne explain kiya integrative biosciences is a combination of a lot of fields all together mm-hmm. which are dealing with the biosciences field of course to research ka aapne baat ki uh, in your opinion uh, what are the basic areas ke jisme ye research progress kar sakta hai Uh, for for those who want to pursue a career in this particular uh, field unke liye because they will definitely sare zaruri nahi ke wo practical field mein jaye some some will also go to the research side as well kyunki hamara jo podcast ka theme jo hai it's it's linking our our different topics to career to wo log jo research side pe jana chahte hain in this particular field uh, what are the uh, what are the areas that they can actually opt for to or kahan ja sakte hain aur direction kya hogi in other words what you're asking is what are the hot areas of research yes. right now uh, in this world uh, before i answer that question mm. i'm just going to you know talk about one small thing this field integrative mm. bioscience mm. it is dependent over research so it doesn't matter up this direction mein jao up teaching direction mein jao up industry mein jao up policy mein jao ab jahan bhi jana chahte ho research will lie at the core of yes. it yes okay because we are studying life right yeah. sorry did i hit something that's perfectly okay. fine <laughs> so we are yeah i get i tend to get very excited when we start <laughs> okay. talking yes. about yes. life and integrative bio that's sciences. actually good for us kyunki hamare kabhi kabhar wo hum ye bhi dar rahe hote hain ki hum jo bol rahe hote hain hamari audience zone out na ho jaye so it's good no, don't uh, get bored <laughs> yes. come to the good part <laughs> okay right. okay yes please continue so yeah. Uh, yeah, so research inevitable. वो तो करना पड़ेगा सब स्टूडेंट्स को ठीक है एंड इवन दो दिस वर्ल्ड इज लाइक काइंड ऑफ हैवी रिसर्च एंड पॉप कल्चर हैज गिवन अस यू नो दिस सेंस ऑफ रिसर्च वेयर देयर इज लाइक बिग लैब्स एंड यू डोंट एंटर इजीली यू डोंट एग्जिट इजीली देयर हैज टू बी यू हैव टू वेयर दैट हैज मैट सूट यस एब्सोल्युटली एंड दोस पाइप्स आर गेटिंग कनेक्टेड टू यू एंड यस एक्चुअली दैट डज हैपन ओके दैट्स अ सर्टेन बायोसेफ्टी लेवल दैट नीड्स टू बी फॉलोड विद सर्टेन रिसर्चेस लेकिन it can be a simpler way as well for example i'm doing a survey mm. when a questionnaire bana liya i'm going out um uh, asking a bunch of people to mm. answer let's mm. just again i'll take the example of cancer yes i just want to ask ke cancer mere area of residence mein kitna hai mm-hmm. and i just w- go ahead and go on a spree of um, this doing this survey and i start asking people ke aapki family mein pehle se kitna tha aapke ghar mein kisi ko hai ke nahi hai what is your fear associated with yes. it what are these different risk factors ke jo aapki life mein involved hai ya nahi so on the basis of that i will take that data then mm-hmm. that it comes to me mm-hmm. i will analyze it and mm-hmm. i'll have some statistics related to it yes that is research yep too yani yeah, that is research yes. too yes jo jo ke hum bada jisse humne bahut bada ek bala banaya hua ha and that is research too and at the same time Yes, we can go to that biosafety big level four type of research that mm. is seen in pop culture and movies. Yes, but in our labs, we tend to work with these small, small things like microorganisms, like water samples, like soil samples, mm. Mm. like you know. Actually, on the genetic level, we take a plant, we try to change the expression of that plant. Plant green is. मैं चाह रही हूँ मुझे नहीं पसंद मुझे पर्पल फ्लावर चाहिए वैसे हम इस चीज़ को फंड नहीं करते वी कुड डू दैट बट we tend to see okay what thing is beneficial for the mankind absolutely, right absolutely yes so on the basis of that we want to change a trait mm-hmm. let's just say that has to do with the color of the plant right mai usko change karna chahti hu and then i take uh, this do this engineering trick that i told you about yep, right yep, okay. so yeah research is over there now mm-hmm. what are the cutting edge research areas over here right yes. now first thing i will talk about health uh, you okay. know currently we've all been out of the covid-19 pandemic absolutely yes and when that hit we were not prepared for it right even yes, though pandemics true. have happened in the past True. influenza a happened somewhere around uh, 19 somewhere in 1970s i suppose yes but that thing has been aham usko kya sama hum use general flu kehte hain har saal aap ye sunte honge ke flu shot le flu shot le right Anji. october mein liya jata hai september mein liya jata hai aapko effect december mein hoga mm-hmm. it's this vaccine okay. is that influenza a vaccine mm-hmm. but that influenza a virus 
انسانوں کی طرح جس طرح انسان جلدی رنگ بدلتا ہے اس طرح انفلوئنزا اے وائرس جلدی جلدی چینج ہو رہا ہے سم تھنگ دیٹ وی کال ایولوشن ایولوشنری پروسیس سو وی آر ٹرائنگ ٹو سروائیو دیٹس اے لونگ تھنگ ٹو دیٹس آلسو ٹرائنگ ٹو سروائیو رائٹ وی آر اٹیکنگ ود ویکسین ناؤ اٹس ناٹ ایکسپٹنگ ایٹ سو وی کم اپ ود اے نیو ویکسین ایوری ٹائم دیر از انٹیگریٹو بائی سائنس فار یو اور جسٹ سمپلی لیٹس جسٹ کال اٹ بائی ٹیکنالوجی ایٹ دس پوائنٹ رائٹ سو وی آر کمنگ اپ وی آر ٹرائنگ ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ دا وائرس وی آر ٹرائنگ ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ کہ ان سا ہیومن کے ساتھ وائرس کی کیا انٹریکشن ہو رہی ہے اینڈ وٹ ڈو وی نیڈ ٹو ڈو سوری وٹ ڈو وی نیڈ ٹو ڈو ان آڈر ٹو یو نو break that interaction yes so we come up with a new vaccine uh-huh. now covid 19 pandemic ke baad hamare paas ek nayi vaccine aa gayi naya vaccine type aa gaya jise hum messenger rna vaccine kehte hain okay. i'm not going to go in the details of that but we knew it as a pfizer vaccine right yes yes which, yes, yes, which yes. was the most efficient most yep. the one that worked wonders right uh-huh, uh-huh. so um there's integrative bio science for you okay It basically use these computational methods mm. mathematics chemistry mm. and biology and understood Uh, all the previous forms of the virus, now the current. Also, we can predict that the next virus can come. Mm. So before a COVID-20 hits, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. let's just say, mm-hmm. so we can already be prepared. Yes. We might have already um, a vaccine on our hand and that, that will uh, deal with it. Yes, and that is where research helps us. In, uh, it helps us in assessments and forecasting as well. جیسے آپ نے کہا کہ ہم آگے پریڈکٹ کر سکتے ہیں تو ریسرچ کا یہ فائدہ بھی ہو سکتا ہے لنکنگ بریلینٹلی ایکسپلین میم اصل میں دا تھنگ از می ہیونگ اے بیک گراؤنڈ نان ٹیکنیکل بیک گراؤنڈ آئی ایم اے مینجمنٹ اسٹوڈنٹ میں نے کبھی بھی یہ نام پہلے نہیں سنے ہوئے تھے جو آپ ابھی بول رہی ہیں لیکن آئی ایم ایکچولی گیٹنگ ایٹ سو آئی ہوپ کہ ہمارے جو آڈینس میں ہوگی دا وے یو آر بریلینٹلی ایکسپلیننگ آل دیز تھنگس آئی ہوپ سو آئی ہوپ سو کہ سب کو سمجھ آ رہی ہے سو سو آئی ریلی اپریشیٹ دیٹ ویل ٹیک کویشچن لیٹر اوکے یس یس فار شو فار شو وی ویل اچھا میم بایو سائنسز کی بات اگر ہم کریں تو تھوڑا سا کیریئر ریلیٹڈ بات بھی کرتے ہیں اسپیسیفکلی دا مارکیٹ آف پاکستان رائٹ ہم نے اگر سنا ہو بایولوجی والے جو ہوتے ہیں وہ میڈیکل کرنے جاتے ہیں میڈیکل کا نام سن سنتے ہی ہمارے ذہن میں ایک ہی چیز آتی ہے اٹس ایم بی بی ایس یا جو بی ڈی ایس یا جو ڈاکٹرز ہمارے ہیں یہ فیلڈس جو ابھی آئے ہیں ناٹ جسٹ بایو بایو میڈیکل سائنسز بایو ٹیکنالوجی بھی ہے مائکرو بایولوجی بھی ہے اس کے باقاعدہ بھی بیچلرس پروگرامس اور ماسٹرس ڈگریز ہمارے انٹروڈیوس ہوئے ہیں اینڈ یونیورسٹیز آر اور کافی ہائی میرٹ میں تو اگر ایک اسٹوڈنٹ فار دوز ہو جو کہ ابھی اپنے ایف ایس سی میں انٹر لیول ایگزامس دے چکے ہیں یا دے رہے ہیں اینڈ دے وانٹ ٹو آپٹ فار اے فیلڈ ادر دین ایم بی بی ایس اگر وہ اس فیلڈ میں نہیں جانا چاہتے بٹ دے وانٹ سم 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 تھنگ سملر ٹو دیٹ تو پھر یہ ہماری فیلڈز آ جاتے ہیں جیسے کہ انٹیگریٹو بایو سائنسز بایو ٹیکنالوجی وٹ شوڈ بی دی انسپریشن یعنی وہ جا کر سکتے ہیں وٹ ڈو یو تھنک از دا فیوچر آف دس آف دیز پرٹیکولر فیلڈس اور ڈاکٹری سے ہٹ کے ان کا بھی کوئی فیوچر ہو سکتا ہے ان پاکستان اسپیسیفکلی باہر تو ہوگا ڈیفینیٹلی بیکاز دے ہیو آل دی لیبز اینڈ فیسلٹیز اویلیبل یہاں پہ سو شوڈ دے آپٹ فار دس پرٹیکولر فیلڈ اگر کرے بھی وٹ وڈ دیئر کیریئر پراسپیکٹس بھی Okay, you're asking this question from a very right person. Mm-hmm. Actually, I was one of those students who yes. actually whose goal was to get into medical and mm. not by my own design, actually. Okay. So it was not not out of my own volition. Mm. It's something that society has fed to you, right? That you have to be this, a successful person. That's right. And for success, one of the things that being a scientist and a researcher taught me is that be an analyst, a critical mm. thinker of mm-hmm. a situation, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Now, what have we considered the indicators of success, uh-huh. right? Mm-hmm. Am I going to be earning more? Mm. Agar earning more ki baat aage, mm. Let's just take this one point and I'm yes. going to take some time explaining this thing, right? Please, please do. Agar it has to do with earning more. Mm. Yes, if you're a passionate scientist, mm. if you follow through, mm-hmm. if you are actually into science for the sake of science, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. There is money in this. Yes. Now I will quote someone here, Bill Gates. Oh, yeah. Okay. Who we know as one of the richest guys on the Hanzi, face of earth Hanzi, right Hanzi, Hanzi. and bill gates did say that if he had to go back mm. or go to say degree leni thi he would take the degree of biotechnology okay the guy okay. is speaking from a business point of yes. view by the way yes, yes not because yes. like he has these science scientific juices flowing in here maybe it's that mm. but i'll just go assume being a businessman mm-hmm. he's talking about business mm-hmm. And the reason he says that is because he knows it has potential for making big money. Yes. Right? And it's, it has the potential for, I'll just go a step further. It will revolutionize the world. It is doing okay. that. Okay. But again, science and research is not a quick process. It's mm-hmm. a slow process. At some point, it will get quick. Okay. Because we are working on that, right? One of the, um, let's just call it, um, you know, misunderstanding among people mm-hmm. or something that, 
that kind of did not resonate well with people was that the COVID-19 vaccine was uh, came very quickly in the market. Mm-hmm. Now, a lot of people think, uh, you know, we had those ton of conspiracy theories, virus engineer, why yes. you, why, 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 right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. There can be some truth to it. Mm-hmm. But as a scientist, I know that vaccine ka jaldi banna is... The processes have been made better, right? Okay. From what it was done before. Mm-hmm. Before it would be made in three to five years. All right. And that's still being hopeful. Mm-hmm. Uh, but within a year, because the processes have been improved, the machinery has been improved, mm-hmm. uh, the manpower is not as uh, not demand, past mm-hmm. So all these improvements made it possible that it came in market. Mein aai. Now mm-hmm. coming back to the business point of yes. view, the amount of demand is coming in the market, the amount of demand and the time gap is mm-hmm. uh, coming at the same time, the amount of business is coming in. If on the other hand, you're interested in, let's just say, making a strong career, yes. right? Not the money factor mm-hmm. or not just the money factor, <laughs> right? You want to make a strong career, society says, wow. Mm-hmm. Kidna- and religion, of course, ke we know that doctor ke baare mein hum kehte hain ke tib nabi pak sallallahu alaihi wasallam ko ek bahut achhi feel thi bahut pasand thi and isme khidmat ka element hai right so a person who is trying to solve problem before they uh, it goes to the doctor what do you think about that khidmat ka element hai ki nahi yes 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 because uh, and i am going to start talking about this one amazing amazing advancement mm-hmm. in integrative biosciences which is called personalized precision medicine okay and when i say precision medicine um and let me not confuse it with personalized medicine even though the, the term is used you know interchangeably okay like in when i personalized medicine past maybe hoti thi jab hum ek bande ko dekhte hum kehte okay how much dose of medicine does this person need let's mm-hmm. just say diabetes ka patient hai isko main kitne time interval ke baad kitna kitna insulin mm-hmm. agar insulin mm-hmm. dependent mm-hmm. hai to mm-hmm. de sakte mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. now precision medicine mm-hmm. is actually going a step further okay it is checking out the genetic data mm-hmm. of a human mm-hmm. and figuring out okay, what medicine would work for this person mm. what wouldn't work mm. even before this does this person have you know the predisposition to a certain disease okay. let's say diabetes from genetic uh, data mm-hmm. or agar uske andar ye predisposition hai Take so care. what should be his diet what should be his lifestyle right. what what kind of risk factors should this guy be cutting down on mm. so that it's called preventive medicine mm. right mm-hmm. and the other is curative medicine to pre- uh, we're working on the preventive integrative bioscience is working on the preventive side as well as on the curative side mm-hmm. once this person has to go to a doctor mm-hmm. and does have a disease mm-hmm. now you know had aap dawai lete honge let's just say simple कॉल पोल हाँ जी यस यस तो उसके साथ भी आपके पास एक प्रिस्क्रिप्शन आती है ना उसके अंदर जो होती है एंड उसके बाद साथ आप देखोगे साइड इफेक्ट्स क्या है राइट एंड देन यू माइट नॉट हैव दैट साइड इफेक्ट बट योर सिस्टर माइट हैव दैट साइड इफेक्ट और बोथ ऑफ यू माइट हैव दैट साइड इफेक्ट लेकिन शायद आपका बहुत ज्यादा हो और उनका कम हो नो दिस हैज टू डू विथ योर जेनेटिक डाटा एंड इट हैज टू डू विथ द फैक्ट कि आपकी मेडिसिन आपकी जेनेटिक्स के साथ डिफरेंटली इंटरेक्ट करिए क्योंकि जेनेटिक डेटा में कुछ डिफरेंस है और उसके वाले के साथ डिफरेंट इंटरेक्ट करिए नो व्हाट विल प्रोसेशन मेडिसिन डू इट विल बेसिकली टेक दिस डाटा एंड फिगर आउट कि इस दवाई का मुझे किस किस किस्म का वेरिएंट बनाना चाहिए ताकि वो इन सब के लिए एप्लीकेबल हो सो हम इसके साथ क्या क्या करें एक तो हम देख रहे हैं कि हमारी दवाई के साइड इफेक्ट्स ना हो टॉक्सिक इफेक्ट्स ना हो एलर्जिक इफेक्ट्स ना हो ठीक है और इफेक्टिव हो सब पॉपुलेशन के लिए एंड द होल गोल इज एक्चुअली दिस इमेजिन अ वर्ल्ड जहाँ पे देर इज दिस एनी पर्सन एनी रैंडम पर्सन गोज टू अ फार्मेसी एंड दे हैव जस्ट अ लिस्ट यू नो and like your id card there's another card on them which basically carries their genetic data okay. and they provide it and they would say okay i need a medicine for di- um, i i need insulin mm. i have diabetes i need insulin okay. this is my genetic data give me the insulin variant a to z what whichever variant works for me the pharmacist looks at it runs a program and say mm. okay this way variant works for you yes. zero side effects yes probably solving the problem let's absolutely. hope it solves the problem absolutely. entirely absolutely absolutely oh, okay i've been just talking about medical so far okay. so let me come health yani uh-huh. so yeah you, your basic question was that what kind of careers can they have you know mm. should they opt for it or not mm. so let me go to a next one let's talk about let's start talking about agriculture or food okay. you know with the growing population hamara food demand badhta ja raha hai we are yeah. actually currently without realizing it we are in a global food crisis yes because are, it didn't reach yeah. us in pakistan as much as it reached in other countries but mm. i will take a typical example of the kids in ethiopia and you mm. would see a lot of them are malnutrition and it's mm-hmm. sad it's just sad looking at them the way True. their bodies are 
and you know there's like uh, a saying ke you cannot think well if you do not eat well yes. right yes so and there's a certain share word i can't think of it right now but what it really means is that <coughs> Uh, jiska, yeah, it goes something like this. Ek rat ke do se ho buka. Mm-hmm. Tum bata wo le roti ya wo le takht, takhti, yes. It doesn't rhyme. Okay. We've, we've I just got like, the point. We've got the so curse. Yes. Paraphrased yes. it. Okay. Yes. Anyways. Mm-hmm. So now what is, how does integrative biosciences come into play? Mm-hmm. First thing. Um, let's just talk about computer or the IT sector first. Mm-hmm. It will take mm-hmm. the data. Mm-hmm. It will figure out, it will take some bioinformatic approach. Mm-hmm. It will figure out ke hamare paas, um, kis kis area mein kis kis food ki shortage hai by extension mm-hmm. humans ke andar jo malnutrition humans hai unme kaun si um, jo hamare paas food supplement hai mm-hmm. ya kaun sa element hai ke jiski shortage is actually causing this problem mm-hmm. this disease mm-hmm. this um, you know uh, not a regular structure that should be yes. for a human being yes. right yes. so the, the deficiency in the physical form in the mental forms mm-hmm. right So in that case we take all that data mm-hmm. and we tend to you know revolutionize the agriculture industry as in making more food Tika. yielding uh-huh. yielding more food mm-hmm. at the same time making it better mm-hmm. I will give you an example Okay and it's like my favorite example to give I all keep right. on giving it to students as well it's all called right. golden rice Okay and you must have eaten it too without realizing it sort of has a deeper yellow kind of a color to mm-hmm. it you okay. know the regular sela rice choti aapki it looks something like that Okay anyways This golden rice has is genetically engineered to include a certain precursor mm-hmm. ke jab aap usse consume karenge aap khayenge regular rice ki tarah aapki body mein uh, convert ho jayega vitamin A ko mm-hmm. okay, okay. So vitamin A ya retinol you know is very important mm-hmm. if there's any ladies watching they would know okay retinol okay. is used in a lot of skin care all products right, actually all right and it's like very important in developing normal vision mm-hmm. now there was a research done in Africa mm-hmm. and a ton of research has been done on it but I'll just give this one example okay in a certain place uh, the children of that place were like uh, by a whopping 96 97% they were either very low in vision low in vision okay. and in very worst cases actually blind oh, okay all right and they should have been shouldn't have been blind because their genetic data did not indicate all right. a variant for blindness okay. right okay so well it was figured out they did not have a good availability of vitamin a mm. and then golden rice is um, there's this is the, there is this one approach called biofortification okay. jisme hum food items mein ko supplement karte hain us cheez ke sath ke jo mm, kisi population mein kam ho so jab mm. population ek uh, regular food staple leta hai mm. to um, consequently they will just take that supplement alongside it yes. so yeah these guys were fed golden rice golden okay. rice was made for them they were fed it after three months the data was taken by 75% mm. those cases were decreased the lower vision cases were okay. decreased Tika. so this like imagine it mm. and let's just start talking about other things which should include uh, you know um, including such elements in plants mm. uh, that should provide you resistance against diseases mm-hmm. actually let me talk about monoclonal antibodies mm. uh, let me just say it's kind of a vaccine okay, okay vaccine hame virus yeah invading agent say protect karta hai, right je, je. so monoclonal antibodies kind, kind of a vaccine now there's plants ki jisme jiske andar monoclonal antibodies produce ki ja rahi hai mm-hmm. and that whenever that plant is consumed in a, uh, it's a vaccine against a very particular type of an antigen okay. a very particular okay. type of an invading agent okay. right so we know this uh, agent is going to invade or mm. is invading already or is going to invade at some point and in a particular population ke jahan pe wahan pe zara prevalent hai uski existence so we feed this kind of thing mm-hmm. we can do two things mm. we can feed this kind of food to them we can actually isolate this food mm. which is taking me to the next point which is industry mm. industry hum kis tarah revolutionize karte mm-hmm. i take this plant i isolate and purify these monoclonal antibodies it's a medicine mm-hmm. i can supply to the market yes right yes there's money in it again absolutely and yeah. it's very great for like as a pakistani and as a as a like red blooded pakistani you know i would say ke um currently Pakistan is lagging behind. It's, mm. it's a sad thing for us ke a lot of people are interested in research actually and they're doing doing research too but hum papers pe papers publish karte jaate hain. Papers publish karne ka fayda ye fayda hai iska ke like the people the society would the scientific community would know ke kya ho gaya hai now what should be the next step right? But jab tak hum us paper ko product mein convert nahi karenge 
after some time kuch saal baad like nobody's going to go and read that paper Absolutely. so when you convert it into a product mm. you can sell it you can export it you're bringing business to pakistan mm-hmm. and you're kind of becoming self sufficient mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and currently more than ever you are a management sciences person mm-hmm. so you would understand it better okay mm-hmm. we are it's sort of in a crisis right now what are they calling it mm-hmm. it's sort of a dip- we are moving towards a depression on yes. a national level yes. right yes. and bringing it's more important now more than ever to mm-hmm. bring more business to pakistan absolutely it is gen- yeah. so that we st- stop relying on funds and mm-hmm. you know taking loans right mm-hmm. first of all we can pay mm-hmm. back mm-hmm. and then we can go a step further and we generate business we start giving loans Mm-hmm. I know it's premature to say but mm-hmm. why not mm-hmm. I know integrity by science Dreams do come true we hope it does yes It has the potential yes. to do that yeah, so why not is. Yes 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 true Right true. Did I miss true. something out I don't think so I don't <laughs> think so it was uh, an extremely uh, detailed answer and I hope ke jo queries hamare the mere do teen sawal aur bhi the aur mashallah se aapne usi isi answer mein you 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 oh. covered you covered those so Sorry and uh, that no, that's that's fine that's fine uh, bahut uh, एक अच्छे तरीके से जो है तो यू एक्सप्लेन एक छोटा सा मेरा एक सवाल है आई वुड एक्चुअली वांट वेरी यू नो अ ब्रीफ आंसर ऑन दैट बिफोर वी जंप इनटू द क्विक फायर राउंड के बायोमेडिकल साइंसेस इंटीग्रेटिव बायोमेडिकल साइंसेस एज अ फील्ड पाकिस्तान में अगर लोग कोई करना चाहते हैं इफ इफ दे वॉन्ट इफ दे डोंट हैव द फैसिलिटीज ऑफ डूइंग रिसर्च और या वो कर, अगर वो उनके पास नहीं है दे ओनली क्योंकि हमारे लोग ओरिएटेड ज़्यादातर आपको पता भी होगा उनको जॉब चाहिए होती है हम एक मैं एक बिल्कुल एक ले एक आम आदमी ऑर्डनरी पर्सन के परस्पेक्टिव से बात कर रहा हूँ अगर वो बायोमेडिकल साइंसेस करते हैं यहाँ पे उनको बेसिक अपॉर्चुनिटीज़ कहाँ मिलेंगी सो so दैट सिर्फ उनको मोटिवेट करने के लिए फिर डेफिनेटली वन दे जंप इन टू इट फिर वो सारी चीज़ें जो हैं तो एवरी एस्पेक्ट वो उनको क्लियर हो जाएंगे कि दे कैन डू रिसर्च एंड एवरी ऑफ द सॉट वो कौन से एरियाज़ में जंप कर सकते हैं सो दैट दे कैन हैव दे कैन इनिशिएट अ करियर इन इट एक बहुत एक सिंपल क्वेश्चन और इसी तरह से सिंपल ताकि हमारे नॉर्मल व्यूअर्स के लिए हो योर कीवर्ड बीइंग इनिशिएट राइट सो फॉर्चूनेटली एंड अनफॉर्चूनेटली और आई शुड से अनफॉर्चूनेटली बट येट फॉर्चूनेटली अभी फिलहाल हमारे पास पाकिस्तान के अंदर बिकॉज़ देयर इज नॉट वेरी मेनी बायो साइंटिस्ट आई थिंक दैट्स वन ऑफ द बेसिक चैलेंजेस इट्स अ न्यू फील्ड राइट ओवर हियर एंड इट्स लाइक कंपैरेटिवली अ न्यू फील्ड राइट एंड अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल हु एक्चुअली गिव अप ऑन मेडिसिन कम इन हियर I was going to take the test again mm. uh, medicine ka lekin I did not want to waste more time than I already had so I okay. got into biotechnology but once I got into biotechnology I didn't even take the test again okay. so I kind of you know found home in there mm. if you're not interested in first thing first agar aapko science life science is my interest nahi hai mm. studying life mein interest nahi hai so I would suggest don't get okay. into biotechnology okay. Okay. like at some point you're going to get into okay what's more practical about it as in isme monetary gain kitna hai mm-hmm. again i would we were back to my that answer where i said get isme monetary gain hai provided mm-hmm. you're passionate you follow yes. through right yes. and yes. passionate and follow through mm-hmm. karne ke liye basic interest ka hona zarurat hai mm-hmm. you should love doing that right exactly yes. so i would i would not go as far as to say love doing it mm-hmm. क्योंकि हम स्टूडेंट ले रहे हैं एफ या ए लेवल से जो निकल रहे हैं राइट या एम एस के वे से मैं अगर ले रहे हैं तो ऑलरेडी एक लाइफ साइंसेस एंड इंटीग्रेट बाई साइंसेज हम बायोलॉजी के स्टूडेंट कंप्यूटर्स के स्टूडेंट्स एक्सेप्ट करते हैं बिकॉज वी मेक दिस सॉफ्टवेयर राइट वेयर देर इज एप्स अबाउट देर इज एप्स दैट एक्चुअली ब्रिंग अस यू नो डाटा ओवर यू नो आवर साइंटिफिक प्रोसीजर्स एंड एवरी थिंग हम इंजीनियर्स लेना चाहते हैं एज ए बायो मेडिकल इंजीनियरिंग इज अ फील्ड नैनो टेक्नोलॉजी इज इमर्जिंग एज अ वेरी एडवांस फील्ड वी हैव नैनो टेक्नोलॉजी वी डूंग लॉट ऑफ नैनो टेक्नोलॉजी रिसर्च राइट नाउ बट दैन मेकिंग इट इंटीग्रेटिव नैनो टेक्नोलॉजी रिसर्च वी नीड पीपल फ्राम अदर फील्ड एट द सेम टाइम सो वी एक्सेप्ट पीपल ऑल राइट लेकिन अगेन साइंस में वो बेसिक इंटरेस्ट हो मैं एज्यूम करूंगी कि उस लेवल पे जब स्टूडेंट एटीन सेवनटीन को देर प्रॉब्ली स्टिल फिगरिंग आउट वट टू डू राइट सो दे हैव नॉट एक्चुअली अंडरस्टूड दम सेल्व बेटर इन अफ एट दैट पॉइंट सम ऑफ दैम हैव मोस्ट ऑफ दैम हैव एंड नाउ बेसिक इंटरेस्ट अगर हो आपने बॉटनी पढ़ी है जोलॉजी पढ़ी है बायोलॉजी पढ़ी है यू हैव फेल्ट लाइक यू इन्जॉय द सब्जेक्ट आई एम एक्चुअली अर्जिंग यू टू गेट इन टू द फील्ड वाई बिकॉज you would see the potential that the field yes, has aapko uh, textbooks jo hote hain na schools colleges mm-hmm. ke wo is pe itna zyada um in depth aapko like insight nahi de sakte mm-hmm. is pe because mm-hmm. there's like that time limitation they have to teach other things yep. so actually biotechnology related jo ek topic hota tha zoology ki book mein uh, my teacher didn't teach that they mm-hmm. were like it's unimportant okay. come on i made that into a career it's oh, not unimportant yes yes, yes it yes. is something and again i would say it and again i would say it i would highlight it and underscore it mm. 
it will revolutionize the world mm-hmm. the world mm-hmm. bill gates yes yeah, yes would true. know it better than him absolutely right? because talking like revolution absolutely so, absolutely um, Yeah so when they get into it we have this teaching career mm-hmm. then we have certain labs precision medicine ki maine baat ki no sikaz university um rmi rahman medical institute and government of kp mm-hmm. in ki ek um ja- joint and giant collaboration precision hai. medicine precision, lab right exactly. yes exactly yes, precision yes. medicine lab it uh, the home to it is rmi mm-hmm. and it's basically working on this so hamare paas labs is tarah hamare paas nih national institute mm-hmm. of health and the point is हमारे पास जितने इसमें स्टूडेंट्स ज़्यादा आएंगे उतने एरियाज ऑफ रिसर्च ओपन होंगे उतना हमारे पास जॉब अपॉर्चुनिटी बढ़ेगी इसकी एंड अगेन आई वुड आल्सो आई लाइक टू मेंशन वन थिंग हमारे पास अभी ऑडियंस स्टूडेंट्स हैं सो आई वुड लाइक टू यू नो अप्रिशिएट दैम एंड इनक्रेज दैम एक चीज़ के बारे में वो जिस भी फील्ड में जाए दे हैव टू कम आउट फ्राम दैट माइंड सेट कि मैं यहाँ से निकलूँगा तो मेरे लिए एक जॉब होगी कहीं पे एग्जैक्ट कहीं पे मेरे पास अपॉर्चुनिटी आएगी मैं अप्लाई करूँगा बिकॉज अलॉन्ग साइड यू थाउजेंड्स ऑफ अदर पीपल्स आर अप्लाइंग राइट सो इट्स अ गुड थिंग टू हैव दैट कॉन्फिडेंस के नहीं मैं ही सेलेक्ट होगा एट द सेम टाइम क्रिएट जॉब फॉर योर सेल्फ यू नो आई वॉज टीचिंग दिस थिंग दर डे इन क्लास and we were talking about agriculture we talk about something this that's called bio farming okay. not f a r farming p h a r farming okay. right it comes from bio pharmaceutical pharmaceuticals yeah and literally what it literally means is that making medicine inside a living body okay Now how is ma- medicine made inside a living body mm. so i'll just give you a small example because we have to proceed from here um take a certain uh you know organism like a sheep mm. or a cow mm. and what do we get from that mm-hmm. we get meat and we we get milk right yes yes and i have gene- i will genetically alter that organism to make a certain medicine in its milk mm. it is not an invasive process mm-hmm. it will not interfere with any of the processes vital processes mm-hmm. of that organism but every time i extract its milk it has tons of that medicine actually mm. and there's statistics related to it i'll just off the top of my head you know um if uh, i have a herd of goats 200 mm. goat herd right mm. there is an investment in it but at the end of a year if it's a genetically altered goat you get metric tons of a certain medicine mm. let's just say for example insulin okay. right which is otherwise and now you had asked me one question in the beginning mm-hmm. that biosciences and integrative sciences biosciences how is that you know how did it develop into that mm. and how did it progress into that mm. so let's talk uh, uh, production of insulin mm. in the past 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 mm-hmm. हम लेते थे उससे पिग्स एंड काउस के लेवर से बोवीन एंड पोरसिन इंसुलिन एंड देर वॉज अ लॉट ऑफ एथिकल इशूज विद दैट एंड एट द सेम टाइम वन ऑफ द एथिकल इशूज बींग द वन दैट हर्ट्स मीज दैट वन ग्राम ऑफ इंसुलिन के लिए हम फिफ्टी थाउजेंड एंड आई एम नॉट चोकिंग फिफ्टी थाउजेंड पिग लिवर्स ओके सो यू फार्मिंग पिग्स and mm. we then killing them and mm. when you're taking them their mm. livers <laughs> and then we're like extracting insulin mm. from them mm. and just one gram of it uh. and aapke bas demand kitni hai yes. bahut zyada yes now with biosciences advancement ke sath we actually started doing that with bacteria okay lab ke andar okay. bacteria I, i was gonna say bacteria multiplies like rabbits actually rabbits multiply like bacteria so proverb <laughs> okay. right but yes. like uh hamare paas lab mein ek din mein thousands of grams ban rahe hain mm. and now integrative biosciences i'm making that in goat milk mm. so metric tons of that i'm getting from the goat milk yes. and i'm isolating it mere paas mera farm bhi hai ah. so whatever i'm doing with them i'm taking wool from it mm. uh, let's just say at some mm-hmm. point but i'm ta- taking a medicine from it as well yes and imagine how much resources that will save us actually as as a country who's struggling so to, you know to, there's to, a certain um ke hamare paas agar hum industry level pe ab ye bana rahe industry level pe ek bio reactor banana theek hai uh, which will take like 5 uh, 3 to 5 years okay. to be fully established mm. right which will take around 400 million us dollars mm. compared to that this thing mm-hmm. within one year uh, less than 80 dollar 80 million dollars sorry beautiful so Brilliant. Yes. that's like roughly a 320% decrease, decrease yes, on absolutely. the amount of money you're using absolutely. right absolutely yeah, absolutely absolutely so we're and in the long run environment let's talk environment mm. we are decreasing the resources that we are crazily consuming on, mm. and on this earth <laughs> and like kind of pushing it towards you know extinction <laughs> <laughs> actually <laughs> a lot of things towards extinction <laughs> <laughs> we're begging to you know we're sort of begging for this temperature globing warming to happen industrialization sure. to destroy yes. everything so this kind of thing saves up on that absolutely it does it does it does green technology that's why we call <laughs> yes. it a green technology yes. as well yes 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 uh okay uh mam kuch raha to nahi gaya 
uh, regarding integrative bio sensors i don't know you tell me you ask <laughs> i'm i'm here i'm like happy to answer I'm, i'm actually amazed by the new insights that i wasn't yani mujhe nahi tha pata is field ke bare mein so uh, i wouldn't be someone who uh, who's expected to expect a lot of uh, you know uh, such things uh, to be a part of this conversation like and i learned a lot today and i hope all of us jo ke dekh rahe hain unhone bhi kafi seekha hoga uh, again i don't want this podcast to end but due to the fact that we are short on time uh, we have to jump into our quick fire round so i'll ask you some questions and uh, you just have to answer in a yes or no okay theek hai um, that's it yes or no yes ha yahi yahi maza aata hai yahi maza aata hai hamare sare guests they want to explain but i don't give them this opportunity to main aage chala jata hu okay bad limitation but yes. all right <laughs> so do you think uh, integrative biosciences and biotechnology will uh, revolutionize the field of life sciences yes or no yes 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 okay okay that shows that that shows it okay is it possible for integrative biosciences and biotechnology to unlock new potential in genetic engineering yes okay okay i'm not going <laughs> to let you answer yes, after that <laughs> okay could integrative biosciences lead to breakthroughs in drug development yes okay <laughs> ओके मुझे बहुत मजा आ रहा है सो डू यू बिलीव दैट इंटीग्रेटिव बायो साइंस एंड बायो टेक्नोलॉजी विल हेल्प सॉल्व सम सम ऑफ द बिगेस्ट ग्लोबल हेल्थ चैलेंजेस यस ठीक है गुड इंटीग्रेटिव बायो साइंसेस लीड टू न्यू एडवांसमेंट्स इन रीजनरेटिव मेडिसिन यस यस ओके डू यू बिलीव दैट इंटीग्रेटिव बायो साइंसेस विल प्ले अ क्रूशियल रोल इन शेपिंग द फ्यूचर ऑफ लाइफ साइंसेस यस अंडरलाइंड हाइलाइटेड ओके ठीक है सो दैट वॉज ऑल फ्रॉम द यस और नो पोर्शन एंड आई एम ग्लैड कि आपने जस्ट थ्रो सम लाइट ओवर इट लाइक द टिप ऑफ द आइस बर्ग लाइक अ वेरी टाइनी पोर्शन ऑफ दैट देर सो मच मोर टू इट and like there's सो मच दैट आई डोंट नो एक्चुअली एंड देन फ्रॉम वर आई नो आई आई फील लाइक आई जस्ट not talked about 1% of it mm-hmm. so we could maybe do at some point we, we will, uh, a we part 2 and a part 3 and maybe absolutely absolutely we would love take to note, have guys. you again yes <laughs> <laughs> okay uh, now uh, i'll just give you two options and mm-hmm. you have to select either one of them okay okay uh, first of all these are not related to biosciences ye bahut ek generic hai this is just for fun okay aapko humne bahut tak aapko humne bahut tak hai so to, to refresh you a bit Uh, would you rather be able to communicate with animals or speak every human language uh, fluently change of topic all of a sudden speak every human language fluently okay okay so you don't want to communicate with other i didn't uh, say i didn't want that i okay. was going to say both okay okay you, have, you both. have to That's choose an, one i'm an integrative bio scientist okay. we believe in all okay but 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 we have the limitation of providing you with yeah, only okay, one well option yeah okay well the second so one then yes i'm a i'm a basic pakistani so yeah <laughs> <laughs> okay would you rather have a pet dinosaur or a pet unicorn pet unicorn unicorn but however if it's a dragon then a pet dragon okay okay so it so that you can also use yes. it for flying and purposes all right would you rather be able to photosynthesize like a plant or regenerate limbs like a starfish photosynthesize like, like a, a plant, plant. Oh, okay self sufficient okay okay uh, okay uh, which uh, ability would you rather have to control gravity or to control time 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 control mm-hmm. that 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 was actually one of my fantasies when i was when i was younger Mac yeah, Mac Sosa like time ko kaise okay didn't fantasize oh, yes, about that yes okay war of the there was a certain movie when i was a kid and it was called um war of worlds okay yeah. it would be like three fingers just coming from out of space and uh-huh. like whenever it would land on earth it would some s- disrupt the time or something okay okay and the humans were of course trying to survive and working against it so okay and when i say i was a kid i mean like i was 3 or 4 years old something like that mm-hmm. and i remember it and so we yeah, also used to play that uh, freeze uh, the, the game where, where where you you would call uh, settle someone you you would say freeze and he would he would freeze and wouldn't be able to do anything that uh-huh. was also our fantasy and you know uh, proving that we can control time actually mm-hmm. but it wasn't the truth <laughs> okay would you rather be able to breathe underwater or fly like a bird breathe fly breathe fly fly like a bird okay okay <laughs> would you rather have super strength or the ability to turn invisible super strength okay okay all right working on it okay <laughs> uh, in in my case i would like to turn invisible actually <coughs> okay so different people <laughs> yeah so would you rather be able to transform into uh, any animal or be able to shape shift into any human form 
एनी शेफ शेफ्ट ह्यूमन फॉर्म राइट ओके अच्छा मैम टी और कॉफी कॉफी ओके व्हाट वुड यू रादर हैव मनी और फेम विद मनी यू कैन गेट फेम राइट विद मनी यू कैन गेट फेम राइट नॉट नेसेसरीली I know a lot of people who are not famous. Any. I have to select any. Hmm. So I would say Okay, on this last question, money. I'll give you both. Uh, <gasps> Thank you. you. But again, stuff. I would say money because that okay. opens up the avenue for doing so much more. I'll write. Right? I'll write. And fame with it it will come itself, right? Yeah, but it goes with your death. So well, it can't stay. I mean, it does stay, okay. but like you could do more philanthropy work with mm, money mm, in my opinion perhaps mm. you could you could use fame to your mm, uh, mm, advantage as well mm-hmm, mm-hmm. but i think it's easier to use money so okay okay <laughs> all right i guess that was it for today uh, of Ooh, course and for sure uh, because we still uh, were left out uh, of of certain topics that we would have been discussing over here but Sadly. due to shortage of time we weren't able to do that mm-hmm. so i guess we will call you again for a detailed podcast it wouldn't would be a podcast that. it would it would actually be uh, you know specifically related to this particular topic All it would right. kind of Perfect. be a lecture and stuff so we would love to have you again over here but first things first uh i along with all of the team that we have we thank you again for your presence uh, i thank podcast. you guys okay. i mean you gave me an opportunity to speak okay. over this okay. thing okay okay we be grateful i love talking about it be grateful. and you be guys grateful. are supposed to you know throw in some comments where okay. you demand a part 2 yes. when i'm here again okay so uh to all the viewers who are watching us uh, do uh, share your comments do like and subscribe this particular video and this channel or uh, agar if you want another episode as ma'am said uh, we would love to do that as well uh, uh, this is emaj avet uh, see you again in the next episode uh, this is the podcast of sikos chronicles allah hafiz bye allah hafiz <laughs>